It is a very old story, whispered among those who dare to tread near the crumbling ruins of the old house on the hill. One chilling night, a girl's voice echoed through the air, screaming and calling for help. The voice was unmistakable. It was his girlfriend, Emma. Heart pounding, her boyfriend, Jake, raced toward the ominous structure. With every step he took, her cries intensified, mingling with sinister whispers that sent chills down his spine. We will kill you. We are ghosts. Why did you come here? Determined to save her, Jake leaped over the rusted gate, the air thick with an unnatural fog. He burst through the creaking door, but as he stepped inside, the world around him blurred into darkness. The screams faded into an eerie silence, leaving him in a suffocating void. Unbeknownst to Jake, Emma's sister had followed him, her presence hidden in the shadows. Just then, the old clock on the wall, long stopped, began to tick once more, its sound reverberating through the desolate halls. In that moment of distraction, Emma attempted to escape the clutches of the malevolent spirits. She dashed down the corridor, but they were faster. With a blood-curdling scream, the ghosts dragged her back, her lifeless body pinned to the wall, her eyes still searching for Jake. Jake, oblivious to her fate, felt a strange sensation wash over him. He couldn't shake the feeling that something was terribly wrong. Suddenly, a flicker of movement caught his eye. There, on the wall, a dark shadow of Emma lingered, twisted and contorted, her spirit now bound to the house, a witch trapped between realms. The stillness of the house was shattered when her spirit broke free, gliding toward the door as if drawn by an invisible force. Where was she going? The sound of the clock continued its relentless ticking, but now it seemed to be counting down to something sinister. Then, from a nearby grave, a skeletal hand reached up, grasping her spirit and pulling her into the depths of the earth. As Emma's spirit was consumed, a flurry of bats erupted from the cemetery, their wings flapping wildly in the night air. A gust of wind swept through, sending leaves spiraling like frantic whispers of the past. Suddenly, a sinister pumpkin, glowing with an otherworldly light, began to laugh, its voice echoing through the cemetery. The laughter turned into screams as the ghosts of the crematorium scattered, terrified by the unleashed chaos. Amidst the turmoil, Jake felt a cold breeze and glanced toward the window of the old house. There stood Emma's spirit, a serene smile on her ghostly face, waving goodbye. Her eyes held a haunting promise, a reminder of love forever intertwined with darkness. As the night deepened, the old house remained silent once more, its secrets buried deep within its decaying walls, waiting for the next soul brave enough to enter.